the next two weeks, you're going to see Coco here starting to breaking the um, all the cement. We're talking about millions of dollars going in the, into uh, infrastructure, and I'm talking about um, anywhere between five to nine million. And if you ask me why five to nine million, because we need to break it to see what's underneath. So we know it can vary. And that's why the city of Windsor, and not only the city of Windsor, just to be on record here, Brownfield is every municipality, unless I'm wrong, it's across the province. Uh, but uh, Drew and his, his friend at City Hall um, assure us that they're going to work with us step to step to make sure that we will um, get this um, Brownfield up and approved, and I think it's been approved by council, so we're starting. So we're going to spend the capital front, and they have certain element of years, if I'm not mistaken, 10 or 13 years, so we uh, will receive the money down the road. So Windsor need um, this housing, and I said all along, um, when the time come, when, they, um, um, when we see the needs, and, and we see the economy allow us to do so, we're going to go ahead. It's not like we wake up in the morning and decide, okay, we're going to do it. This is not a work, gentlemen, for years. And like the mayor said, we're working with them for three years now. And in fact, is, uh, yeah, for three years, it was, was the first year that he took office. And that's the second term. So it's a three, four years that we work on it. Because that's a huge undertaking to work with the provincial government, to work with many uh, um, office in the government and its city hall. The time is right to do it. We're happy to do it. We take a great pride that our major quarter for billion dollar development in the city of Windsor.